I need to know how this happened. I know what I saw. There's no way that was an accident. Noah's accident wasn't an accident. Would anyone want to hurt Noah? Could be anyone. The theater's a family. Like it or not, we're all in this together now. <laughs> The vibe of the show, in my opinion, can be mysterious, but also a little bit comedic. Out of the show, it's like a comedy murder mystery. Except, I'm not murdered. I just made a quick statement for my article on Noah's death. He's not dead. R.I.P. Noah. He's not dead. <laughs> it's very mysterious, kind of dark, similar to Crown Lake. Very whodunit, very mystery. A little frightening. But we also have a lot of comedy pockets, so even though it gets very dark at times, there's also a lot of times where we lighten it up. Uh -oh. It's not like a regular mystery because it's really, really, really funny. But it's also a little spooky because you don't really know what's happening. The whole time you're just trying to figure out who it could be, what's going on. Definitely don't rule anybody out. Doors opening on their own, flickering lights, falling objects. I'm Sophie Michelle and I play Lizzie on Stage Fright. My character, I'm the stage manager, so I'm kind of controlling everything and I'm super ambitious. Half the cast is a wreck. Tuesday will come out of her dressing room. Kai thinks the theater is haunted and Wayne won't even speak to me. Common side effect of accusing someone of manslaughter. My character, Roxy, she's definitely not a theater kid. She is basically like the mean girl, the popular catty type of girl. She just loves the attention. What is wrong with you? Oh, I don't know. Maybe having to bear the weight of our school's emotional well-being? We're trespassing and you're documenting it live. Mikey is a baseball player and he's basically like, like a dog. I think of him like a golden retriever. He attaches to everybody and he's always trying to do good. He's doing his best and he's, he's trying. If I were a library, where would I be? So from my perspective of playing Delia, she's very anti-social. She doesn't really like to talk to anybody. She likes to do her own thing. She does not care at all. She just doesn't care. Party time in the club, huh? What? I was trying to fix the broken fog machine. And I'm straight. All of our characters are so much fun. I cannot wait for you guys to see Stage Right. There's so much fun stuff going on with this show. I mean, if you love theater, it's an awesome show to watch just because it's, it's so fun. You can expect a lot of mystery, a lot of laughs, a lot of funny stuff, even a little romance. The suspense leading up to the last episode, it'll really keep people on the edge of their seats. And some of you, if you pay really careful attention, you might just be able to figure it out before then. <laughs> <laughs>